As someone who excelled in math from a young age and who really enjoys the concreteness of working from a rule set or a list of axioms in order to prove statements, statistics always just caught me off guard. The two schools of knowledge, mathematics and statistics, use numbers and logic for sure. But for me, mathematics was very straightforward, while statistics always felt like there was a lot more room left up to interpretation. That's why I always get a bit confused when statistics is thought of as a mathematics subject. I mean, there's got to be a reason that several colleges and universities have departments of mathematics and statistics. Intentionally separating out stats from the likes of topology, combinatorics, algebra, and other fields of math. And I think stats is separate enough from mathematics at face value to get its own place in the department title. That is, how I understand them, mathematics and statistics are two very different ways of thinking about the world. On the one hand, statistics is experimental at heart and falls more in line with the principles of the sciences. Hypotheses are made, experiments are conducted, and the results of those experiments either tell or confuse us more about a subject, leading to more questions and more statistical experiments. On the other hand, with math, you have a very structured path to a solution that is declared true by logical proof, independent of the limits of your data. Sure, when things are proven or disproven, there are more questions that arise and more logical inquiry takes place, just like more experimentation does in statistics, but they're two very different methods of learning more about our world. Of course, that's not to say that one is better than the other. Although I do find math more appealing, there are some things math can't do. Math can't tell you how tall you'll be or when your next text message will arrive, but stats can give you a pretty good idea by looking at past data and making an educated guess, with things like a statistical estimator, for example. With a bit of math, you may want to show that your estimator is a biased one or not, where here biased has a fixed definition, but whatever you estimate is still just an estimate. It won't necessarily come true, although it might be very close to the actual value. Stats is also used to find correlations between different groups of things or events and give more insight into their relationship to one another. More mathematical stats looks at the properties of distributions and probability in a highly theoretical sense. Even though mathematics and statistics are very different and require different ways of thinking about them, they are closely related. One can generalize different statistical models and ideas in order to learn more about their essential properties through mathematics. And different mathematical problems that have been solved theoretically may not describe a feasible way to calculate a solution for a given example. But tools from statistics can be used to produce algorithms that get very, very close to the solution we know to exist. And sometimes close is good enough. A lot of times, the deeper and deeper you get into the study of statistical methods, the more mathematics comes into the design too. So there is a relationship between mathematics and statistics. Statisticians and mathematicians may not enjoy the other's field at times, but the tools from both fields come in handy every once in a while, making them distinct but closely related fields of work. Anyhow, that is all I have for you today. I'm still getting back into the swing of things. This video is actually the product of a friend of mine who's a teacher reached out because one of her students had asked if I had a video about statistics out uh, after watching my math versus computation video. So I wanted to make this to kind of give my two cents about how I see differences between math and stats, or why I think math and stats are different distinct fields. But again, they are very related though. Anyhow, um, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up uh, and subscribe for more mathematics videos. As always, I am Nathan, this is Chalk, and I will see you next time. <laughs>